few clouds around today. And Chelsea, I do want to mention those large waves along the Pacific West Coast. That's the same storm system that will be impacting our local weather, generating some of those larger waves as we go into the day on Sunday. And there could be some severe weather concerns, so let's check it out. Uh, first off for tonight, no weather issues really to speak of. Temperature's a lot warmer than it has been recently. 55 and 7, 10 o'clock tonight around 53 and midnight tonight, 50 degrees. Look for mostly cloudy sky midnight tonight. No chance of rain. Wind will be dead calm at midnight tonight. Here is a live look over Tuscaloosa. Still a little daylight there on the horizon. Looking west towards downtown. Current temperature 61. Look at the high today. 67 way above normal for this time of the year. Low last night officially in Tuscaloosa at 38 degrees. Across the area clouds again increasing across the state today. And our northern counties, areas like Hamilton and Coleman, a little cooler today. Uh, still pretty warm for this time of year in that part of the state. Uh, but notice the further south you go, a lot warmer there in York at 70 now. Linden at 69 in Marengo County. So across the board, satellite and radar composite, there's some of those clouds today and again. Across the northern half of Alabama, the clouds are a little thicker. Southern Alabama, a little more sunshine. Loud temperatures really to warm nicely today. And really, as we look off towards the west, look at the warmer temperatures back towards the central and southern U.S. Now, 75 in Brownsville. And again, that warm air is moving our way. We'll notice that tomorrow and during the day on Friday. Notice on future cast, though, a few clouds around during the day tomorrow, even today. But notice during the day tomorrow here across Alabama, no rain to speak of, even though we will. We'll have a few clouds passing by, but on Thursday, Thursday night into the day on Friday, still some of those clouds will call it partly cloudy. Uh, there will be some clearing at times, but understand there's going to be a few passing clouds here and there. But again, limited moisture work with some no organized rain chance. We will stay dry locally through the Friday. How about upper 70s approaching 80? On Saturday, some records could be broken across Alabama again on Saturday. Notice here. This is Saturday night. Clouds starting to move back in uh, fairly thick. I think as we go into the day on Sunday as showers and storms will move in late in the day on Sunday. So let's check it out. Uh, that storm system been watching for several days now in our forecast models. Everything continues on track with a chance for strong or possibly severe storms uh, late Sunday and Sunday night. During the day Sunday, we're going to be dry. The main surface front still off towards the west. A severe risk will be west of us, but late Sunday uh, we're talking about close to sunset and afterwards on Sunday, there will be a band of showers and storms work across the state, and those will pack a punch. Some of our latest forecast data suggesting there could be some damaging straight line winds, possibly a spin up tornado or two Sunday evening, Sunday night. So be a weather alert there. Monday, though, that system tracks off towards the east. Any risk of severe weather will be out of here pretty quick early Monday morning. So good news there. Forecast tonight lows back to those upper 40s. Not as cool as last night. We'll top out around 70 tomorrow, partly sunny and a warm day. Expect warm conditions over the next several days. Look at that, 77 as we go into the day on Saturday. I would be surprised if you backyard thermometers touch 80 on Saturday. Uh, that will be approaching record levels. This is going to Sunday, though, late in the day, Sunday and Sunday night. Look for the chance for showers and storms. Some of those could become severe Sunday evening and Sunday 